to all the active participants who are eagerly waiting to learn. Let's not waste much of the time. I hand over the session to Dr. Vimal Jaral. Over to you, sir. Thank you, Dr. Alisha. Dear professors, a very good evening to you all. I'm sorry, it is not a formal session. It is an extended session of the morning. Once again, I apologize for the technical the hit, uh, setback that we had in the morning. I suppose uh, we will have a fruitful session now. Dear professors, I all do appreciate your uh, you know coming back uh, learn for one more session in the evening, having spent your time. Thank you. Now, dear professors, I shall move move ahead with the session straight away with the demonstration because morning I had given you the orientation or maybe uh, a simple orientation on the tool. Now I had a poll that is sent to you all. It, it is there in the screen. I have also shared the results for you. Now how I asked you, how was your experience creating videos with Renda Forest? Many of you have done beautiful videos, explanatory videos for uh, short videos. You know, Renda Forest is enables you to create a short video. So I told you uh, in the morning itself, you know, it helps you to create short videos that could be shared to your students just to remind them certain things or to give them the gist of what you have taught in the lecture. So it, it is an easy and a simple piece of uh, videos that could be circulated for the students just to remind them certain on certain things. All right. Thank you very much, uh, dear professors. And I appreciate all those who submitted your, uh, you know, all those who have shared your videos. That was really amazing and wonderful to see. You know, even the participants appreciated all your efforts that you have made. I suppose, you know, many of you, around 73% of you have said that it was a wonderful experience creating videos and 24 of you. So it comes around uh, nearly 93 or so. 93% uh, have said that it has become wonderful and very good experience. And nearly 6% that is 8 of you have said that good. So please, those of you who have not explored the tool still, please explore it. Okay, right. Let me just share my screen and go ahead with the tool. Now, can I have the assistance of the organizers? Is my screen visible? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, as usually, please type uh, the tool name. Now that we are going to explore is ice cream video editor. Just like type ice cream video editor in Google. Ice cream video editor. It is one word. Ice cream is one word. I know how, uh, all of you are, how many of you are interested in uh, eating ice creams? How many of you are, you know, happy eating ice creams? I suppose everyone, you can give your answers in the chat. Are you all happy in eating ice cream? Yes, everyone. Even those professors or participants with health complications, they like to have ice cream. Right. This ice cream video editor is as simple as eating ice cream. Very simple tool. All of you can get it. it all of you can really do editing with this right i click the first link i click the first link i click the first link this is the tool right one one minute let me come back to you one minute yeah this is the tool okay dear professors have you got it? I shall send you the link. I shall send you the link. Those of you who find it difficult to get the link through Google. Yeah, it is there in the chat. The link is in the chat. Please click the link and you will get this page. And immediately after this, you will have to click this free download. It is supported with 10, 8.1, 8 and 7. And some of the systems, if it is older, if the configuration is not compatible, you may not be able to install this tool. So don't worry. Don't worry. Today's assignment is to develop e-content using this ice cream video editor. But still, if you are unable to do it, we shall give you options at the end of the session. Don't worry. So I just click and I'll be able to download the tool. Double click it and I can install the tool. So I have sent you the installation procedure. How many of you have installed? How many of you are ready with the tool? How many of you have completed installing? installing? Now I would like to just get you the poll now i just give your opinion in the poll give your opinion in the poll how many of you have completed oh, sorry yeah yeah i can get uh, so many numbers yes very good 
sorry sorry the poll is coming again and again yeah how many of you have completed downloading you can give the poll also yeah many many ones here in the chat in the i can also get the numbers in poll uh, professor i have given the link yesterday itself please find some time to install it otherwise you know you cannot have hands on you cannot have hands on experience some of you had the technical difficulty no bother no bother right all right now out of 173 a majority of the participants have downloaded yeah i could get to you a polling yes i'm stopping the poll because it is time right so yes completed is majority so i'm going i request you all to do it along with me right imagine that i have installed okay imagine that i have installed professor shall i skip the installation procedure because i have installed in my system already so i cannot install it again so i request you all to please click this green button and download please green button and download and install it simple procedure double click the installation downloaded version exe file extension file you can install it now i go ahead with the tool now i close this browser and go ahead with the tool just type ice cream after installation see it is the tool ice cream video editor do you see that the yellow color icon you find just click open click open so the tool is loading and this is the simple tool this is the simple tool that we are talking about okay fine now how many of you have got it ready how many of you have have this window how many of you have this window in your system those of you have installed please open it and have this window how many of you have this window can i have your answers in the chat thank you so great of you nice thank you please keep this window ready yes thank you dear professors thank you thank you as i told you in the morning this is a very very simple tool very simple tool it is not a sophisticated or complicated editor simple tool and you can edit it edit for only lesser time and if you want to go for the maximum time or uh, the longer time longer period you have to purchase it so we don't go for it we use only the unpaid version and you don't have track only one track single track and the editing is becomes very simple right now look at i shall explain you the environment this is the place where we have the media files this is the place where we have the media files this is called media library where we enable uh, we, we store or we we import all the media files the media files are video files audio files uh, or text or background anything okay video audio the text color the color color or text all these things will be available here only before we drag it for editing or use it for editing and this is the one this is the one see here this is the one preview 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 place this is this is where we see the editing scene here okay this is the place for preview and this is called a timeline look at here this is called a timeline at the bottom you have the scale like no this is called a timeline you know for every e content or for video very important thing is that is timeline this is where we edit videos this is where we edit the videos okay we edit we do everything we manipulate the multimedia files we manipulate the media files so this is timeline have you understood the process this is media library where we import all that are necessary for the video editing and this is the preview place where you can preview your content and this is where you see all your files or this is where you edit all your media files so this is called a timeline okay with single track you will be understanding with regard to track in the next session okay because you are going to have multiple tracks i will explain you the tracks maybe later the usage of tracks now have you understood media library the preview and timeline have you all understood dear professors press two if you have any clarification you can give me in the chat otherwise you just give me your feedback that you have understood as two if you have any clarification to ask about this you can give to and it is a very simple tool we will be able to make it yes i am also going to orient you to create a e content to be uploaded in youtube or to be uploaded in the college websites 
right now dear professors at the beginning at the beginning this is where no you 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 have the video file now let me just give you a explanation for every bit of it please carefully note it and afterwards we shall make a video okay right click here click that yellow color now add files you see add files do you see that add files yellow color on the top you see yellow color with the plus symbol add files right and when you want to add files you'll have to click here and load your media files just click here and load the media files from my computer i go to holy cross college folder yeah look at here i have got some yeah okay i just take up this 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 picture and some videos with the uh, holy cross college okay some videos yeah see i have got some videos about holy cross college and I'm, i'm taking some videos pictures okay. i have brought it i have brought some files see here yeah, i brought few files i would like to add some more files i click here add files again and i take from here j2 so yesterday we have we had made some tools look at your music download or uh, see we have made some we have made some videos so i brought it i have brought some videos okay and i would like to add some more videos look at here i just click here and add some more videos from day 1 see here we have done some video ppt video look at here ppt videos about computer networks so i just pick that video right i i brought those those videos also so you can bring any files either video files image files or audio files so far the files that i have is only audio the image files uh, sorry only the video files so i would like to bring an image file also look at here i would like to bring an image file uh, go to j3 and see this this image file i am bringing this image file yeah i brought it now i would like to bring an audio file look at here i uh, add file i have my audio file in downloads it is there it is there in the downloads folder so i am just trying to bring that bring an audio file and one more video that i have created no in the morning in the morning we created a video with uh, renda forest so i am just bringing that video also okay i am just taking that video this is the file that we created okay i am i'm just opening so two things that we have brought okay right fine now what do i do i just take up a picture file professors have you all got it have you all got it how to import uh, the files necessary files that you need you should have a plan what are the files needed picture files video files audio files you can bring everything here and store it in or keep it in media media library have you understood process importing files necessary media files have you understood press one process press one have you understood dear process if you have any clarification you can ask me so we have brought the necessary media files into the media library in ice cream video editor right we have brought it now i'm going to import look at here i'm going to import two pictures let me just take up the pictures okay i'm just clicking this picture see i'm just clicking this picture dragging drag and place it here slowly drag and place it here look at here i brought this have you got it dear process click here and slowly drag and place it here have you got it dear process i click drag and place it here okay okay process have you got it you can you can you can do it later now listen here you can do it later i will give you hands up don't worry now after getting this picture what are things that i can do see i have got this picture this picture is fit exactly into the frame it this picture fits exactly into the frame if it doesn't fit for example look at here i have another picture look at here i have another picture look at here i just drag this picture and put it here look at this picture this picture is not fitting into frame this picture is not fitting into frame i have got holy cross college uh, file i have holy cross college uh, name and the logo so now if it is not fitting what should i do at the bottom i have a small window like look at there i have a piece of a small window like do you see that small window so look at my cursor look at my cursor do you see that small window like click add and you have black bars blurred bars no bar custom crop so i just click you with black bar see what happens though the background since the background color is black you see the color is also black 
Now what do I do? I just click use blurred bars. Look at here. Blurred bars. Now if you don't understand, if you don't see that, I would like to add one more file and uh, tell you. Now you, it may not be very clear for you. So I shall deal with one more file, right? Okay, I just delete this. If you want to delete this, you can simply just press the delete and that will go off. So I would like to add a but add a picture that will give you an idea. One minute. For example. I'm adding Kalam's picture. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing it. I'm doing it, Professor. See, look at here. I'm dragging it here and bringing this picture. Look at here. This picture is not fitting into the entire frame. Please understand. This picture is not fitting into the entire frame. It fits only in the center of the frame. Right? It fits only in the center. Now, what should I do if I want to fit it entirely? See, I just go down. There is a small box like. Do you see that? Do you see that? And click that you have some options like black bars, which means if it is not filled, the other part which is not uh, filled with picture will be filled with black bars. Look at here. It is filled with black bars both the sides. Okay. And if I want blurred bars, look at here. See here, now it, it fits it with blurred bars. Okay. Now the third option, no bar. When I click no bar, see, no bar, fully fits. Completely fits. Okay, completely fits into the frame. And the next one is custom crop. Custom crop means you can crop. Look at here. For example, you can crop the file. You can crop the file like this. For example, I want only this. See, you can crop the file. Okay, you can crop the file, right? You can crop from the file, file, picture or video, whatever it may be. I just click done. Okay, dear process. Okay. Now I fit the entire thing into frame. Have you got it? Have you got it, dear professors? Do you know how to fit uh, the pictures or video into the frame? Have you got it, dear professors? Any clarification? Any clarification? Have you got it, dear professors? All of you? Yeah, thank you. I could get. I want all of you to please respond so that I can only uh, by your response I can read your mind. Because we are all connected online. How to crop the video? Yeah, I will tell you. Sir. I will tell you. Don't worry. We have not come into video part, sir. We are not coming to video part. Please understand, we are not coming to video part. Now only the, the, the pictures, right? Okay, fine. Now, I've got two pictures. Please understand, I've got two pictures. How do you apply a transition between one picture to the other picture? Please understand, we call by transitions. One picture to the other picture. Please understand, I will go step by step. One picture to the other picture. There is a plus symbol. Look at here. When you add clips, between two clips, you have transition. You, have, you can apply transition. There is a plus symbol. Do you see that plus symbol? Do you all see that plus symbol? Click that plus symbol. Yes, yes, it's completely offline, Professor. It's completely offline. This tool is offline tool. Yeah. Click that plus symbol and you've got a lot of... Uh, look at here. Do you see that? Uh, see the transition uh, list? And you can apply any of the transitions. For example, I'm applying 180 spin. So what will happen? The first picture and the second picture will move in 180 speed. Look at here. I shall just apply this. I shall play this for you. You can hear itself. You can play and watch the preview. Look at here. See, you can play this. I just click it. Let us see. See here. It comes. Suddenly, see. Do you see that? See that? There is a turn. Have you got it? Have you got it, dear professors? One, once again, let me make it. Look at here. There is a plus symbol here. And click here. And you can, this time, I'm making something else. Warp. See, I've done it. Look at here. Have you process? This is what we call by transition. Have you got it, dear process? Process, have you understood? Can I have your response in the chat? Yeah, thank you. Now, look at here. Now, I'm going to give you some nuances. This is about transition. If you want to uh, understand, if you want to understand more, look at here. I shall take up this this video here. I, I'm taking up this video between Abdul Kalam's picture and this video. I should have a transition. So what should I do? I click this plus symbol once again. Please carefully note it. Click this plus symbol and add a transition which you like very much. Click here and the list of transition is available. From here you can choose any of the transitions. For example, so I would like to go for fade to black or cross or bounce. So I just choose bounce. 
look at here from abdul kalam's video what happens see it bounces and goes for the next video have you got it have you understood transition process so i have made it once again uh, so it 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 can be applied only between two clips right now process have you all understood transitions have you all understood transitions okay fine now i am clicking the first clip look at here i am clicking the first clip whichever clip that you have chosen from the timeline please understand whichever clip that you have chosen from the timeline you can edit using all these things general is here duration is here motion is here i shall tell you every bit of the detail of uh, this so i click general look at here this picture is chosen i am clicking general so here out of general what are the options available look at there see i can increase the brightness of the picture look at here picture or video anything see look at here i am increasing the brightness do you see that see i increase or decrease i increase the brightness of the picture also i can increase the contrast look at here increase or decrease the contrast increase or decrease the contrast and this is about saturation for example if you increase the colors will will be very thick look at here it is so colorful it becomes so colorful and when you bring it down see it comes you know color saturated you know dull color or maybe olden days if you want to represent a olden day buildings look at here you can saturate the colors do you see that the color less do you understand professor this is sat color sat color increasing or saturation see for example same thing i am doing it with abdul kalam picture also don't worry now hue means look at here hue means it changes into different color look at here i just take it see here it changes to different color look at here the color is changing to different colors you see that you see that dear professor this is about change of colors this is hue so there are four options one is brightness increasing brightness increasing the contrast of the picture or video increasing the saturation or decreasing hue color change of colors the entire clip so all these are applicable in comes under general so i have applied this i want to have the original so where do i clip look at here reset to default look at here reset to default do you see that click that reset to default you get the original one you get the original picture okay dear professor so if you don't want to adjust yourself you want to have auto color look at here when i click auto color it automatically adjust the color look at here i just click auto color so this is the auto color adjustment okay and now i want to rotate see look at here when i click it it goes left upside down look at here look at here see i can rotate also right this is rotation flip for example horizontally you can flip or vertically you can flip look at here i am just doing it horizontally see it is upside down see vertically do you get it so these are the various options that you can get it in comes under general have you all got it dear professors so have you understood uh, the options come under general any clarification have you understood the options come under general it is, these are all very simple options okay you can make it so very well please explore immediately once you get back for self practice yes thank you now i am going for duration professor i am going for duration see i am so uh, after doing all these things press done press done is the option same as for video yes 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 for example look at here i am just clicking for video look at here i have clicked for video look at here professor jackmar i have clicked for a video i have selected this video whatever clip that you select that clip alone will be in yellow color see select see that will be highlighted with yellow color frame now i go for general look at here i go for general now look at here same thing look at here same thing look at here do you see that see i am increasing the brightness i can also increase the hue such look at here color changes are you able to see the color see the color changes to different colors do you see that it is also it is also done for videos also right and the speed of the video see for video alone speed speed is for example you can increase the speed for example you can make it very fast or make it slow make it slow or fast okay so i am just reducing you can also reverse re it see here it comes holy cross college now no, i have made it very slow no? i have made it very slow that is why it is like this. so i just made it, make it little faster now see have you got it yeah i have made this video very, very slow now look at it holy cross college 
nagar koi welcome so you can also come in the reverse order so you can you can picture clearly yeah you can you can you can reverse it also for example see here you can reverse the video look at here it comes in the reverse order look at here see it comes in this it goes back got it it goes in the reverse order so i don't want it so i just click it i just click it i don't want it okay now if you want to reset click reset to default so everything is reset everything becomes normal see this is the normal speed holy cross college so i got this right? nagar koi now this is general and next duration i just click duration look at here every clip please understand every clip in the timeline how long should it last long in the video how long should it last how long should it appear so you can fix it for example you want to appear it for 1 second 2 second 3 seconds or by default it is there you can also change for example i want to apply this for 6 seconds see here i just make it to 6 you can also edit it this is duration this is duration okay dear professors if you have only pictures you can apply to all which means all the pictures will be of 6 seconds all the pictures will be of 6 seconds okay professors apply to all so but we don't apply 6 seconds for there is no auto color yeah 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 auto color option is not there so, see because video video will vary with colors no video will vary with colors please understand video and our image that has different parameters okay please both are not same so some options may not be there okay please explore right now when i click six i get private messages also sometimes people wonder why this man is talking something different i get private messages also so i am answering them right so click six click six so when i click six so it, the, this picture lasts for six seconds okay that is the meaning right but videos videos you don't see look at here video videos video clips you don't see that duration why can anyone answer me can anyone answer me for professor jaykumar it up it depends on you you can increase you can increase the duration for any 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 frame see the each one is called as frame okay this is this is a this is a timeline and each clip is called as frame okay yeah already fixed very good professor metilda you have answered correctly yeah professor shiba you have also answered correctly yes yes already it has time so it, it will not have time duration right i go back to picture when i go back to picture look at here dure uh, motion is there what do you mean by motion yeah prefix process working sir yeah very good sir thank you video time is set yes thank you professor thank you thank you very much thank you professor in the money now motion motion means animation how do i animate it how do i animate the picture look at here when i click motion you have different animations see i just choose the animation as zoom out center zoom in right zoom in zoom in center i just choose zoom in center now look at here look at here see slowly it is zooming in do you see that do you see it slowly moving up slowly moving up do you see that slowly moving up once again let me make it see it has it has very simple options okay it has very very simple options and click move up i want move up option so when i click move up see what happens the apple clump picture see when i click here see what happens see it goes moving up okay it comes from do you see that okay do you see that holy cross move college up. so every you can click the clip and you can fix the animation on your own okay dear professors have we got it dear professors so this is this is about motion and crop look at your next two option is crop have you all understood motion this is this gives you animation this gives you animation right and next topic is crop next topic is crop so next feature is crop when i click this crop see for example for abdul kalam i just click crop so when i click crop this frame comes look at carefully look at it see for example when i click scale fit to scale fit to scale to fit means it fits it entirely the picture that i have uploaded fits into the entire frame fits into the entire frame that's what we mean fits into the entire frame scale to fit otherwise i want only the particular portion for example crop i go to crop i can crop it here i can crop it here look at here i can crop it here i can crop see i can crop only this do you get it so only this is done once after cropping you click done and automatically it is fit see i click done it is fit for videos also look at here i just click the videos see crop option is here crop option is here i just click the crop option please understand i click the crop option and you get 
C scale to fit means it is fit. And when I crop, let's see what happens. I can, I can crop it till this. See, for example, I don't want this uh, uh, this this one. Sorry, watermark. So I'm cropping the frame. I'm cropping the frame. Do you get it? Okay, I'm cropping the frame. Press done. Press done. So only the particular portion of the video is done. Look at it. I just play this video. Look at it. Holy Cross College, Nagar Koil. Welcome. Okay, that you uh, all. the corner portion is removed. Cropped. Have you got it, dear professor? Have you understood how to crop? Professor, have you understood how to crop? Professor, have you understood how to crop? Have you all understood how to crop? Okay, fine. The next one is next one is see the see. So far, we have we had the properties of images. General is there where we have color, brightness, and different colors option duration. How, how long should the clip or the uh, should the image should stay? Motion is for animation. Crop is for cropping the picture. And the next one is text. For example, I want to add a text here. I want to add a text here. How do I add a text? Click here. Professor, please carefully note it. Professor, please carefully note it. I just click text, text here. When I click that text, look at here, I have so many options available. Professor, once again, let me make it. See, I'm just clicking one minute. I'm just clicking the frame of Abdul Kalam. Professor Raji, so we, have, we have crossed the next topic. I shall come back to you. Yeah, I will come back to you. That time itself, you should have asked. When I ask, you know, when I ask whether you have understood, if you could type it, I will immediately respond. Okay, I'm sorry. I will come back to you. Sorry. Right. I have chosen Abdul Kalam's picture. Click the text. Click the text. When I click the text, I can put up a text here. See, I click the text. So I have various text options available. I have various text options available. So I can choose any of the option. For example, I would like to choose this one. I would like to choose this one and type Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam. I'm typing Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam. See, I've typed. Now, where do you want to have the text? You want to have the text in the middle. See, look at your position is here. Do you see here the process position is here. See, if you want to keep it on the top, it appears on the top. If you want to keep it at the bottom, it appears in the bottom. If you want to keep it left side, see it appears in the left, see, center. So I want to put it at the bottom. You can also reduce the size of the letters. Look at here, I just reduce. See, I can reduce the size. I can reduce the speed also, the text speed. So every text by default, it has some animations by default. How it comes, how it goes back. Okay, that is what we call by speed. So once I press done, automatically it appears on the clip, on the clip. Okay, I shall do it once again. Look at your process. I click this clip. I want to have the text here. IKC college or FDP or FDP on e-content or workshop on e-content. I would like to apply text here. So how do I add? Click that text here. Please understand. Click that text here and choose any of the text. For example, I would like to choose this one, this text, right? And type here, for example, workshop on, workshop on e-content. Okay, I have typed workshop on e-content. See, I've typed. You can increase the text size. For example, look at here. I've increased the text size. Do you see that? When you increase, the, it, it, it increases. Have you got it? And you can also increase the speed. If you want to keep it on the top, you can keep it on the top. Bottom. And here you can the position. Okay. After selecting, if you don't want it, you can also change the style. Look at here. I can change the style and see how it looks like. Look at here. See, each style is different. Look at here, each style is different. Okay, dear professors, each style of text is different. Okay, you can choose any of the text size. Okay. Have you got it, dear professors? Have you all got it, dear professors? Have you got it how to apply text? Have you got it, dear professors? Have you all got it? Any clarification with this applying text? Have you any clarification with applying text, professors? Please give your queries. I shall answer. I'm looking forward to your queries. Yeah. No query? Okay, I shall move on. Okay, fine. So this is how you apply text, okay, to a frame, to a picture or video. Yes, fine. Now I move on to a video. Look at here, I just move on to video. Now I just press one of the professor asked me again to show me how to crop, how to crop. Look at there. Crop option is available. Look at there, crop option is available. Do you see that crop? Click that crop and you see. Look at your scale to fit means you fit exactly. The entire frame will be fit. Scale to fit means the entire video frame will be fit. 
crop means i can crop a portion of the frame for example look at here i just crop look at here i can click and crop see i can crop only this portion only the center portion alone do you see that process only part of the frame is cropped only the part of the frame is cropped okay see you have the full frame this is the full frame i want only to focus a particular frame i can crop it that's what we call cropping okay this is what i think one one professor asked me raja somebody asked me okay right so this is how you just crop a frame of a video okay cropping means it is not the cutting or trimming trimming is different i shall tell you what is trimming this is about focusing or you know shrinking the area of the video or picture cropping okay now i press done see how how it is done holy cross college nagar koil welcome you all what a dear process have you all got it how to crop it have you all got it process how to crop it now i am going to tell you how to trim it how to trim video how to trim a video now look at your trimming is here trimming is here right i just bring a video see i am just dragging another video a fresh video now this is a video uh, by holy cross college look at here this is a nice video i just play this video you see the holy cross college in the aerial view you see that very beautiful no it is in the aerial view of holy cross college okay fine now what do i do i am going to edit uh, this with the uh, audio option look at here audio audio is here so only for audio is available only for videos okay not for pictures right i shall tell you how to add audio later now editing audio with in the clip in the video clip i just click a video clip and click audio click the audio and you get see here volume you can increase the volume did you listen to did you listen to professor jibin it is recorded don't worry it is recorded don't worry yeah thank you for reminding now look at here i am increasing the volume look at here i am increasing the volume look at here dear professor i play the video also look at you see the difference you see the difference you see the difference professor you see the difference see i can reduce also see i i reduce the audio also so this is how i stop stop it here this is how you increase or decrease the volume volume of the video you can increase or decrease the volume of video okay and and look at your fade in fade out which means fade in means professor please understand fade in means automatically it it slowly starts and slowly ends okay it smoothly starts smoothly ends for example i just make it as fade in look at here i just make it fade in now to start the clip look at your fade in for how many seconds for 1 minute sorry sorry for 1 seconds so i just make it for 5 seconds fade in for 5 seconds and fade out for 5 seconds now look at your carefully noted when i play this slowly see slowly it, it, it doesn't start with me slowly mild it starts okay now it is okay mild way it starts with the music and mild way it ends okay for 5 seconds it, there will not be any music mild it starts and mild it ends see i just go with the next to last 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 see again it goes slowly see we see that see it smoothly finishes have you got it this is what we call by fade in and fade out have you got it dear professor as editors we must know do you understand fade in and fade out smoothly starts with mild and increase the volume and smoothly finishes have you got it have you got it dear professor have you all got it fade in fade out and dear professor this is about uh audio effect see i have chosen next audio next video and i can choose some of the audio for example i have spoken my own voice but i can give the voice of robot look at here i just give the echo i just give the echo see echo voice is here echo i just give and play holy cross holy college cross college nagar koil nagar koil welcome welcome do you get it do you get the echo volume look at here once again i, I see audio effect is here audio effect click here and you fill the echo effect so you get the echo effect i just click echo and press play holy cross holy college cross college nagar koil nagar koil welcome see welcome it echoes do you get it do you get the echo option do you get the echo uh, noise yes now i want to give a noise of robot robotic voice i just give the robotic voice under audio look at the audio effect click audio effect go for robot voice 
So your voice will be converted into robotic voice. It, it comes, but it is very mild. It is very mild. The audio is becomes very mild. See, once again, let me make it. You see, get some volume. I increase the volume only then you will be able to see. Look at here. College, Do you get it? Do you get it? It is my, very mild. Very mild. Do you get it? Do you listen to the sound? Are you able to listen to the sound? This is very mild. Yeah. Now, look at your next uh, next one. Sim, uh, there are so many other uh, voices also. Chorus is here. Look at your chorus is here. Holy Cross College, Nagar Koil. Welcome you and all. There is another effect also is there. Very limited, limited effects. Holy Cross College, Nagar Koil, welcomes you all. So these are all five, five audio filters. Five audio filters are there. Okay. So if you don't like all these audio, so you can set default, reset to default. Okay. So see, all your editing is done afterwards. Whether you like it, you can press done. Otherwise, click reset to default. When I click reset to default, it will get back. Okay, dear process, this is to click reset to default. The original one will come back. So I just click reset to default. I get everything original, right? I press done. Okay, this is with regard to sound audio. And now another option is that I like to trim. I'm going to trim the video. Look at here, this is the video. I'm going to trim the video. Look at here, there is an option trim. There is an option to trim. Okay, process, there is an option to trim. Okay, do you understand? There is an option to trim. When I click here, and this comes. Professor, please carefully note it. Trim. So trimming cannot be done at the beginning, at the at, in the middle. So I can do it at the beginning or at the end. I can do it at the beginning or at the end. Once again, let me make it. Look at here. I just click done. Once again. See, I am clicking this clip. I am clicking this clip and going for trim. The scissors option. Click trim. Click that trim option, and you get this. So for example, it starts. The video starts. With this, see the aerial angle. I don't want to start it from here. So I just want to crop it. See here? I just crop the video. I want the videos to start from here. Look at here. From here. See, I have cropped. I have cropped for five seconds. And I want to crop from the end also. See here? At the yellow color knob, the bar on the top, no? That has to be pressed and dragged. Look at here. See, I'm just dragging here. I don't want from, see, I just wanted to have only till this. Yes, this bus, till this bus. So I want to have a clip only till this. So after trimming from both this side or this side, I can press that. I can press, am I audible? Am I audible is uh, the video and sharing is okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. Just click and see here, yeah, I have trimmed both the places. See, I have cut uh, 20 seconds from the end and uh, 5 seconds from the beginning. So I want only this part. So when I press done, look at here, only that part alone is appear, appearing. Look at here. So see here, I just start this video alone, video clip alone. Look at here. I start with these steps and I have this video and it ends here. See here, that's all. It ends from here. That's all. The video ends with 33 seconds. The remaining portion is see with the bus only. See, I've got it. Have you got it in process? So I cropped exactly. Okay, this is how you crop. Once again, let me Look at here, I just go to crop, sorry, uh, trim. When I go to trim, it appears here. Look at here. I can adjust this yellow color. See, I want to in increase. I want to increase. So I, I want to start from here. I want to start from here. Look at here. Marian. Marian statue. I trim also very, very, see here till this. I want till this it should come. So I have trimmed much more. Press done. When it's done, look at here now. Only that part, all, look at it. So I'm sorry. I play this clip alone. See here. From Marian statue, it goes and we have turned it up to the college building. That's all. Look at here. See? Have you got it? Have you understood trimming process? Have you understood trimming process? Have you all understood trimming? Any clarification with trimming? Professor, have you all understood any clarification with trimming? Professor, can I have your response in the chat? Have you all understood trimming? Yeah, thank you, Professor. Thank you. Thank you. Now I'm going to tell you one more option is that split process is called the split. For example, look at here, I, I just uh, tell you, I just bring this clip again. I would like to have trimming, you see, uh, split, split into pieces. 
for example please carefully note it i can i can fix the clip here for example i have the this clip i can keep the clip and i want to trim here see i want to exactly cut here see i want to cut cut split and i want to have a transition now what do i do i just keep it here select it here in review place and click the split so what happens exactly the clip will be split into two please carefully note it see i have chosen where i want to clip exactly see i keep it here in the preview place and use split option split option on the top click split when i click the split see automatically it is it it comes two pieces two two okay do you have you got it two things now in this clip also i want to trim i want to split into two pieces now look at here i just go with this and now here i want to split exactly so i just click this split see one more clip is coming so here also i want to clip see here from here i want to trim here okay from here okay okay from here exactly i want to trim so i just keep it here and trim here see split split here split so another clip comes okay dear professor you know what is the meaning of splitting into two pieces so we can add transitions for example between this clip to this clip see i can add transition look at here i can add transition see i am adding transition now from this plus symbol using this plus symbol i can add transition see i am adding transitions look at here see now look at look at this clip entirely now see i am starting from the first clip see see here now when i when i see here there is a, there is a transition do you see that there is a transition there is a transition going to be a transition see the transition since the video is shorter the transition is not so much fast it, it went very fast so you will be able to apply transitions so wherever you want keep it there and cut it split it and you can add transitions so with one clip i am cutting a, here and there i can add transitions have you got it dear professor that is splitting a video clip splitting a video clip okay dear professor have you all got it splitting video clip have you all got it dear professor splitting okay fine now finally there is one more option called filters there is one more option called filters effects over video i am going to apply effects over video now i am clicking this clip the first clip of the video i just click the filter look at here i click the filter please carefully note it i click the filter and i get so many filter options okay for example i would like to give old movie filter like old movie like look at here see here it it gives you like old movie old movie effect okay old do you see that see don't want it i click here to reset to default see this is the original one and next one sepia color see, sepia color means the mgr uh, films no olden days films look at here this is what we call by sepia film sepia color okay okay this is about sepia and i want i don't want it look at here i want to have vintage i want to apply vintage look at here i just click vintage vintage means the olden day films again look at here cracky films there is a line in between you also have blurred screen for example you you, you are adding some if you are a teacher of uh, you know social science you are talking about victims you are speaking about women girl children affected so you can blur it for example i just used blur option see here it is blurred the video is blurred so you also have pixelate pixelate means you look at your pixelate means see here it is hidden shaky do you see that it is shaky do you see that process process to do, or do you all see the effects pixelate see here see here it is not very clear see it is pixelate this is what we call by pixelate okay now you also have other filters look at your process you also have other filters for example multiple things for example look at your one frame with multiple frames of the same campus look at here you see that i shall do it with this clip you will understand see i want to have black and white effect look at here i just apply here see black and white image see they get the black and white image, right okay dear professor if you want to have uh, you know uh, fish eye fish eye uh, the appearance of fish eye look at here when i appear fish eye look at here the video is bulged like okay now i just play this look at here we see that this bulge is like okay these are some of the effects okay dear professors or uh, the, the filters some of the filter options okay dear professors have you got it for example blue color alone will be so, so many so many options so many options you can use it right professors have you got this filter have uh, do you understand how to apply this filter option click automatically it will be applied okay dear professors click automatically it will appear so professors so far we have 
elaborators or we have a, we have explored all the options available now i shall tell you the technique of making your e content okay process i am deleting everything i am deleting all the clips see look at here i am deleting all the clips select and click delete select and click delete. professor uma mageshwari could not kindly wait kindly wait for some time they, they will be place now i would like to delete all this now look at here i just click i delete everything i just delete everything i just delete everything now i am going to start first thing is that i start with the with the logo of the college or picture of the college okay picture or introductory video of the college so what do i do i just drag this video see look at here i am bringing this video so first one this clip i put this clip holy cross college holy cross college okay, that nagar koil so this welcome is this is the clip I, i want to start with my college logo for my e content next clip is that i want to start with the title of the e content please understand dear professors i want to add the title of the e content okay how do we add title look at here there is a there is an option add color there is an option add color do you see that add color click that add color option click that add color so i have different color option so i would like to choose this option look at here i would like to choose this option and add the color see the color option is here so what do i do i drag it and bring it here look at here i just drag it and bring it here so i put it here the color is put here now i'm going to add the title for this color i'm going to add title for this color so how do i add title see here when i select this add color next is here i click that text and add the title so i would like to have the title as classic look at here this one or this one so i just type demo on demonstration on demonstration on maybe downloading pictures or free download or downloading pictures or ppt video ppt video demo on ppt video something like demo on e content demo on or revolving presentation on e content something like that or give the title as e content just e content e content development so this is this is how you give the title see you fix the place how do you want the position you can also change the title look at how does it look like see there are various titles see here you can increase the title see the color is by default okay the color is by default okay dear process see i can increase the size see Please that. See, I have got this title and press OK. Okay, dear process. Now what do I do? I would like to apply transition between these two. Please understand. I have added the title card. I would like to add the transition between these two. See, dear plus symbol is here. I just click here and go for some of the nice, you know, animation. Right. I have added the I mean transition. now what do i add i add my photograph and i add a title see who who is presenting who is giving the presentation so you can add your photograph so what do i do i add my photograph so how do i add my photograph i click add file i click the add file and take my photograph from my computer i go to the desktop and take my photograph uh, we are we are finishing we are about to finish the process we are about to complete don't worry we are about to complete so we it will it will last for another uh, the session will be for another 2 minutes that's all 2 3 minutes okay i have a picture i just keep it here i brought it picture brought, brought this picture now what do i do i want to have blurred screen look at here at the bottom you have the screen option click that and you can have black bar or blurred see here blurred blurred option i uh, we have seen it in the first one blurred bars or black bars okay and you can title you can put up the text here next to all this how do you add the text see here click this here click the text here and add the text for example a vimal jaral i'm adding a vimal jaral a vimal jaral so it comes in the bottom so i can make it in the bottom see look at here you can also make the text smaller and you can add see you can add for example click sjc tni sjc trichy okay i have given sjc trichy you can also change the title you want see for example i have changed the title see look at here you can change the title that you like which, which you like okay i have changed the title now i press now after giving the title and i would like to go for animation see here i have have this clip see this one i go for animation motion click that click that and see i just go for some some motion center zoom in center so i have applied motion Now the next clip would be the original clip, actual clip that you have. 
actual clip that you have done whether your ppt video or maybe the video that you have done no your video that you have done take it take that video for example i have i have brought two videos here look at here this is the video this is the clip that we have done okay this is the clip that we have done okay now i would like to add transition between these two clips professor please understand i have added the college uh, uh, you know introductory video uh, the logo introductory next one the title of uh, the e content next one i add my picture and put uh, my name and uh, the other details and next one the original content your ppt video or screen captured video drag it and put it here so i have added now i would like to add the transition so i have added transitions now look at here i have added transitions now what do you do at the end i would like to add thank you note i would like to add thank you note so how do i add thank you note add color is here click add color click add color and click any of this clip see for example i would like to take this clip or i would like to take the plain one plain color add see this black color i just bring it and add it here now i have added now how to add the text you know text is here click the text and you can press thank you for watching thank you for watching okay i put thank you for watching so i can you can even uh, add some see see okay i have put a nice right put done and i have done everything i have done that's all the video clip is ready the e content is ready okay professor so professor please understand i have added the video introductory video second one is title look at here second one is title and the third one is my picture and the fourth one is the original video and the fifth one is i have added my thank you note okay or the end note okay have you all understood here professor this is a sequence is my audio syncing is the audio syncing process is the audio uh, what i speak uh, it's relevant to right finally finally we are about to end finally i am going to add a mild music so what do i do i just take up the music look at here i just bring the music take the music drag it look at here drag it and keep it at the bottom look at here i am keeping it at the bottom i have added the music have you got it here process now what do i do i have to decrease the volume of this music so go to audio please go to audio and decrease the volume see i am just decreasing the volume i can listen to it after decreasing see i decrease the volume i decrease the volume very mild okay okay i decrease the volume okay i decrease the volume uh, professor have you all understood uh, okay for, for, for past 5 minutes i i know it is uh, there is a delay latency is there in the video latency is there in the video you are unable to but have you all got it have you all got the nuances of editing video or editing e content professor have you all understood professor have you all understood if you have understood press 1 if you have understood press 1 finally after adding video and other aspects now i would like to show you the preview look at here i am going to show you the preview click here and get the preview look at here holy cross college nagar koil welcomes you all this is the video process that we have done greetings from kerimal jaral giving you a ah, demonstration no, 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 on how to download the video attached have audio will this audio interrupt no you have to keep it mild see it is as a background voice it is as a background so keep it mild keep it mild and keep it as a background okay okay madam so after adding everything simple addition of text and other things so finally i would please carefully note it finally you have to press export video look at there uh, professor uh, yeah uh, dr sukin sir so you can add voice over you see here you cannot add voice over please understand here you cannot add voice over whatever you can do do it in ppt video or screen capture video and bring it here and uh, you can add only the music here, not voice over if you want to add the voice over but it will not sync it will not sync you can also bring audio file and keep it at the bottom but it will not sync so it is better you can keep it you can use it ppt video where you can have the voice over or the screen capture video that we have done yesterday so you can have the voice over there itself and bring here only for editing only for compiling only for compiling okay have i made it clear professor only for compiling you can bring it thank you professor have i made you clear no, thank you now look at here click export video finally professor after editing click export video 
when you click export video your video will be exported the final rendering will be done that's all dear professors see look at here this where you just type the name for example first video or uh, ice cream video ice cream video i just make it as ice cream video where do you want to store see the place has to be mentioned so i just take it as in the desktop holy cross college folder day 3 i have chosen the folder and see the folder is chosen what is the format please select mp4 please select mp4 please select mp4 hd resolution all the remaining parameters can be the same don't change it please don't change it only one thing that i would like to tell you is that hd hd is that 1280 into 720 pixel 1280 into 720 pixel look at your process if you want to make it full hd you know what do you mean by resolution per square inch per square inch how many grains how many pixel grains we call it as pixels how many pixels dots that can be fixed so totally 1280 into 720 that number of grains so if you increase the picture quality will be better so i would like to go for hd look at here when i click i can go for hd full hd full hd is 1920 into 1080 1920 into 1080 okay professor so i would like to go for hd for first time okay i just click hd and finally convert as project kind can finally press export that's all your video will be ready after some time see here it is getting converted this is what we call by rendering or exporting is it same for 2010 version also yes yes it is here. see professor this is not uh, this is not uh, different with different versions see, see you are talking about windows you are talking about windows okay you are talking about windows this tool is different this is uh, this is another tool it's a video editor it's nothing connected with the operating system okay professor yes so that's all dear professors so uh, you can share the feedback link madam you can share the feedback link and professors please those who would like to have professors please there is a there's going to be a session on professors there is going to be a session on jam board there is going to be a session on jam board it becomes optional those who would like to sit for a jam board those who would like to listen you can you can stay back there's going to be a session on jam board how to use jam board there was a request from the organizers there was a request from the organizers that i should deal with jam board so it becomes optional those of you who would like to go with jam board or who would like to explore jam board you are welcome please stay back and you can explore jam board also now over to you dear professor if you have any clarification with this tool you can ask you can you can raise your hand or you can just give your queries in the chat as and when you fill your feedback link professor said the expert is also about to done look at here 84 percentage 85 once it is completed i will play you the video but thank you professor jj thank you professor i am looking forward to now it is now it is ready look at here professor now the video is ready i will like i am opening the folder look at here the video that we have done look at here professor this is the video that we have done please watch it please watch it this is how your your e content should be your assignment should be for today look at here holy cross college nagar koil welcomes you all see the mild music going on at the back greetings from a vimal jaral giving you a demonstration okay professor now i go to the I end of the video see all using it for recording see, thank you for watching with that it ends okay dear professor i suppose holy cross call professor they will permit you 10 minutes more than that you will have to leave the box up in the, the, the what is that uh, watermark will be there watermark will be there more than 10 minutes also 10 clips only you can add only 10 clips only you can add more than that you, you, watermark will be added yeah thank you thank you professor so those of you would like to have any clarification if you want to talk to me or if you want to clarify please raise your hand raise your hand or you can talk to me over the mic also you can you can unmute yourself and talk professor mahalakshmi you can unmute and talk professor mahalakshmi you can unmute and talk you raise your hand good evening sir good evening good evening sir good evening i am sister antin mary uh, sir we have chosen this hd no hd yeah, yeah, yeah. why don't we go for full hd because 
yeah 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 very well very well very well sister since uh, sister why i have got a hd because it will take longer time full hd will take long time and the file size also will be heavy if you okay. are going yeah. for if you are going for uh, you know quality one you go for full hd sister definitely you can go for then all the more yeah. when we upload it in the youtube even hd is okay with the frame size 9 uh, 16 is to yes, 9 of course of course hd okay. is okay. okay if you go for full hd it will be a detailed picture very uh, quality even even uh, you know beyond full hd is also available even if you are beyond full hd is also available you can use it okay madam okay okay sister. so there is no confusion with the hd and full hd because usually for frame size we go for 1920 1080 that's right that's right sister hd less than for, that yeah see for example i understand your query sister for youtube hd itself will more than enough if you want to enhance the quality little more you can go for full hd even beyond that even beyond uh, uh, that full hd also there is there are options okay sister yes sir and one more question uh, like uh, on your on your image you just put a thing there was a background without background yes, just uh, that uh, text should be on your image without any background there was white some design was there one minute behind sister. the I text a, i just take a picture. is it the which one you are telling sister your image in the second slide it's second or third one a third one. one yeah third one. okay sister yeah and you letter gave a letter there is a board we don't we okay. want only that letter means sister that is that is see see that you must understand sister see that is style sister that is style of that fixed side fixed one see look at here you can go for something else okay sister yeah. this doesn't yes, go yes. with border yeah. look at here yes. this doesn't go with border this doesn't go with yes, border this yeah with border. yes sir thank you yes okay sister yeah yeah, yeah. thank you sister it first sister thank you sister nice that uh, you asked for this question thank you sister any other queries dear participants dear participants if you want to ask for queries please please turn on your mic you can turn on your mic professor you can turn on your mic you can turn on your mic professor thank you professor uma thank you sir can we trim and place audio for images yes 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 see professor jabin you understand this is not a full fledged video editor a simple video so you can start see we are going to start video editing slowly so i am introducing video editing slowly slowly that you should have the taste of video editing then we are moving ahead okay so we will have open shot a tool called open shot and uh, monday we will have windows movie maker full fledged movie maker where we will see all the options okay yeah any other queries dear professors professor amuda would you like to ask for any clarification professor amuda your mic is on okay if there are no queries professor have you have you any queries professor can i have your queries if no queries shall we move on to the next part have you completed your feedback so i shall give you time to complete the feedback so that we can move on to the next part the optional part how to extend the audio file for full length see there is an option professor look at it look at your professor madam look at it i just speak here go to audio there is not loop audio do you see that loop audio okay do you see that loop audio madam madam do you see that loop audio look at here loop audio click loop audio automatically it will be extended even if it is a small clip it will play again and again until you end the video okay loop audio is there what is the difference between motion and transaction professor motion is that uh, motion is uh, in the clip the entire clip is moving the entire clip moves transition is that one clip to the other clip movement of one clip to the other clip okay have you got it dear professor for example look at here see this picture is here when i when i run this picture see between this picture see look at there look at carefully see see there is a there is a there is a turn and turn out no? there is a turn out a vimal one clip to the other clip there is a transition and if you want to run the clip itself to move that is motion Okay, professor. Have you got it? Have you got it, professor? Professor Asus, yeah. Thank you. So I am waiting for you all Hello? to have exposure on. Yes, ma'am. Hello, yes, sir. Good evening, yes, sir. Yes. Good evening, ma'am. Ah, uh, good evening, sir. So I I have installed the app, sir. Ice cream video editor. But yes, uh, when I click it, it yeah. is asking that do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Yeah, yeah. You sir. just. Yeah, yeah, it's normal one, madam. It is normal one. 
it is now okay. just means you want to insert yeah yes yes you click yes, yes. No okay problem. okay thank you thank you prof sir thank, thank, thank you any other queries dear professors so thank you for uh, you know coming in the afternoon session or evening session too sorry for the inconvenience caused in the morning sorry so i'm waiting for your uh, queries dear prof yeah sir uh, i have a doubt uh, when yeah. we uh, export the uh, thing to google drive or uh, after finishing the uh, 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 the editing in uh, uh, ice cream video editor uh, can we uh, export it to google drive or where exactly should be see you can do it in the local disk madam that's what i showed you you can take it in the local disk right afterwards if you want to explode it in google drive you can click but but that you should be logged in you should have logged in to google okay. drive and the google drive account okay. should be ready only then you can okay. just upload the same video into google drive or youtube man. both are available you can you can try try okay. on your own see when you click export okay. thank you thank professor, you yeah, thank you thank you thank you professor babila the time limit is 10 minutes you can go up to 10 minutes 10 frames 10 frames only 10 frames it is not the time 10 frames the amount of frame that you use and 10 minutes it is limited it is limited beyond that you will have the watermark now i whatever i edited will not have watermark but when you go beyond that it will have watermark but i told you know at the beginning 10 minutes we will do for e content short videos make short videos 5 minutes 6 minutes 7 minutes that's enough wonderfully this morning one professor professor darling selvi created a video for research process within 5 minutes he was able to cover uh, at least half unit okay that you can do see in class we take for long time in track but in e content even uh, half an hour content can be shrink into 5 minutes content we can very well do that yeah try any other queries dear professors see 10 frame mean 10 video means the video should not exceed 10 minutes the video or image anything should not exceed 10 minutes otherwise it will ask you to upgrade Okay, you try. You try explore on your own. Any other thing, dear professors? So those pro have a great evening, dear professors. Shall we move on to the next part of uh, the presentation today, professors? If there are no queries, shall we move on to the next part of uh, the extra session that you asked for? Many of uh, uh, I think Holy Cross College professors wanted to know it. So I'm going to explore Google Jamboard. Okay, have you all filled it, professors? Have you all completed? Now let me just wait for your poll. Have you all completed? Professors, all completed uh, filling the feedback. Please give your opinion here so that I can, based on that, I can move. Ah, uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, the sequence yes. of uh, render forest. Uh, Yeah. Uh, that uh, in the feedback form, uh, just uh, I got that question. Uh, yeah. I have a doubt in that. Please Actually, please what is the uh, real creating video? Uh, then after that, the style, uh, then music, uh, then preview. That will be the one I think. Uh, 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 madam, I cannot. Uh, I sorry, madam. I cannot. Uh, shall I tell you tomorrow, madam? Because it is it is one of the questions. Sure. Sure. It is one of the sure. questions. Sure. I shall deal it tomorrow. Every sure. day I deal the questions. Sure. I will deal it. Yes, Even sir. I told you know I shall tell you uh, uh, generally. See, first thing is that uh, you choose template. First thing you choose the template. Second, what do you do? You edit uh, the image and audio. Sorry, image and uh, text. The next thing you go for style. You add music, then go for preview. Yeah, that is uh, that is sequence. that is what uh, just I uh, uh, mentioned, but it shows us wrong. Uh, that's why I got this confusion. I'll come back to you, madam. Okay, madam, don't worry. If it is sure, wrongly sir, sure, marked, sure. we will give you marks. Don't worry. Okay. Sure, sir. No, no issues of marks. Just uh, it's a learning process. That's right. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. 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 Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. We will come back to you. We will come back to you. Very. We will. We will analyze the question tomorrow. Yeah. Thank you. So, professors, I think twelve of you are still filling it. Please fill it soon. Fill it soon. Twelve of you are still filling it. See, look at here. Twelve of you are still filling it. Please fill it. madam shall we move on madam yes sir yes sir okay uh, professor so we are this this becomes optional session this becomes optional those of you who have uh, who have completed and who would like to leave you are welcome to leave have a great evening madam do we have class tomorrow have we not announced no sir no. we don't have we do not have class Uh, professors those who haven't completed the assignments can complete your assignments tomorrow okay
thank you professor santakumari is asking how long i don't know madam it depends on you so when you ask for clarification it the session becomes longer <laughs> okay it depends on you okay as i start let me make it uh, quickly yeah i am taking you all to a browser please go for a browser please go for browser take up a browser i am taking up a browser one minute dear process i start uh, from fresh is it visible now dear process is it visible yes sir yes sir yeah i'm starting a browser look at here i'm starting a browser right there you type jamboard process please type jamboard jamboard okay jamboard click jamboard type jamboard type jamboard uh, sir sorry for interrupting now it is there in the classroom itself no sir when we do the teaching that also can be taken or we have to open a new one yeah. From yes, yes, very well, very well, madam, very well. It is not in the classroom, madam. It is not in the classroom. It is available in Google Meet. It is integrated with Google Meet, so you can click oh, okay. in Google yeah. Meet from there. Okay. You can bring it. Yeah, you can bring okay. bring from there. Both are same, madam. Okay. See, you can either go this way or go that way. Okay, you can okay. click there Thank in you. Google Meet also. Right, very good. Now click Jamboard. This is the link. Jamboard dot Google dot com. Usually, this is the link. Jamboard dot Google dot com. I give you the link in the chat. You can copy this link. This is the link. click. Okay, look at here. I've got uh, some Jamboard done already. Look at here, few Jamboards, the model Jamboard that is done already. So I'm going for a new one. See, professors, please understand. Once you just click Google Jamboard, this link, you will have to log into your Google account. Right now, I have my Google account already logged in. Already, I have logged in, so it is ready for me. It is ready for me. But if you are doing it for the first time, you have to log into your Google account, your Gmail account. Okay, right. Now, if you want to go for a new board, fresh board, what should you do? Click that plus symbol. There is a plus symbol at the bottom. Click that. When I click that, there is a new board appears. Have you got it, process? Look at here. There is a plus symbol and new board appears. Have you got it? Have you got it? Have you all got it? The new board appears. Okay. Now here, I will tell you one by one. I will tell you. Yeah, I, I would like to listen to your feedback also. Based on that, only I can go ahead, right? Now look at here. The first thing is that you have pen option. You have pen option. Click that, and you have different you tips. Pen tips. You have different pen tips available. Okay, you have different pen tips available. I think one of the mic is on. Professors, one of the mic is on. Yeah, okay. Please turn it off. Professors, one of your mic is on. i just open the mic for clarification so you can enable your mic but uh, please turn it on if it is mistakenly done right thank you turn it off sorry now click here turn pen tips is here look at here this tip is see small thin tip and this is thick one and this is this one is see here a uh, marker like and the next one is painting like look at here see you get the difference see you can use this for uh, you know mathematics some or making derivations or writing something look at here i have the color also for example look at here i can i can take the any color i can take any color see a plus b the whole square okay process you can write anything see for example right now i am writing with the mouse so my handwriting may not be good you know professors many of the professors here they use uh, you know graphic tablet graphic tablet you can use uh, graphic tablet so you you use uh, how many of you use graphics tablet How many of you how few use graphic tablet? How many of you use graphic tablet, or how many of you have the idea of graphic tablet? Press one. How many of you know what is graphic tablet, or how many of you use idea of graphic tablet? Press one. If you don't know, press two. If you don't know, press two. So many do only. Okay, fine. The professor Swakin is here. Professor Swakin is by one teacher. He is here. He uses graphic tablet. Uh, professor Swakin, can you please give your experience on graphic tablet? that you use just for a minute okay i think he is i don't know whether he is there or not okay right now let me tell you graphic tablet is a simple tool see look at it it's a simple tool like a slide like i shall just show you the graphic tablet also look at it
this is graphic tablet look at here a pen tab yeah yeah yes yes pen tab yeah pen tablet it is pen tablet yeah pen tablet only yeah you are right the other name is pen tablet yeah pen tablet or graphic tablet see it is like a slide so you can connect it like a plug and play you can connect it to any system or input device as input device through usb and you write like a pen and paper whatever you write it appears exactly over the screen okay for us it will be very difficult for us to write it in with the mouse so if you use this graphic tablet it costs around see 3700 it starts and even you can have a graphic tablet of uh, you know costly 1 to 25000 or so there are so many available so i am not marketing here let me go ahead so that is with the help of graphic tablet if you write you will be able to make it fine fine one see this is eraser second option is eraser look at here this is eraser i can erase it i can erase it right instead of erasing you can also clear the frame see there is an option clear the frame so entirely it goes off okay dear professors now look at here i just take up uh, the pen pen and write uh, some formulas look at here i just take up this and write some formulas or something like that for example see usually the one and only formula that i know is a plus b the whole square that too may not be correct sometimes okay a, a plus b the whole square so the option is a square plus 2ab plus b square okay right see here if you want to go for the next iteration you can go and you can write something like that for example see it is not the next iteration just for uh, okay see you can write something okay you can go for the next frame also look at here if you if you have completed see this letters are looking big, bigger because i do it with mouse but when you write it with graphic tablet it will be very small and it will be easy for the students to get it the entire sum can be worked out if you want to go for the next frame look at here you can click the next see you can click the next see second frame see this is second frame see the, i go for the next frame on the top you see here on the top you see see i go for third frame see look at your third frame i go for next frame fourth frame see i go for fourth frame see see here each frame third frame second frame first frame see one mathematics sum cannot be completed or one derivations cannot be completed at a particular frame you can have frame by frame you can have frame by frame okay professors have you got it have you got the usage of writing with pen you can also choose the pen you can choose the color of the pen look at here you can choose the color of the pen colorfully you can write the green color is there other colors are also there and you can also use with the thick thick thicker one see thick one thick thick one see pen tip is here okay this is eraser and this is eraser dear professor this is eraser right you can erase it or you can clear the frame and the next thing is very important thing is that i would like to go for new one look at your process i would like to go for a new board how do you go for new board just click here and go for the new board look at here i just click here one minute i can save the board look at here i am saving the board this board as sample sample one i am saving the board as sample one sample one okay i have made it now i want to go for a new one so i just go click the new one one minute the bottom you see look here i have gone out and there is a plus symbol i go for the new board i go for the new board click the new plus symbol at the bottom and you get a new board so i get a new board right now i'm going to tell you the usage of adding a picture for example if you are a science teacher i, I will tell you different possibilities of adding a picture look at here there is a add image option is here add image can anyone tell me a picture that could be taken from internet to, to add for example generally about anatomy if you are a zoology teacher look at your add image when i click add image and there is an option comes there is also option you can upload the image from the file from local computer or you can upload from google image okay i click the google image and get the image from here for example human anatomy i just take up an image human anatomy just search search for the image search for the image just press enter you will have so many pictures out of this you can choose a picture which you like very much with you uh, for explanation you can take up a picture and store it in the diagram uh, sorry store it in the board for example i would like to choose this picture maybe this picture i would like to choose this picture press insert click and press insert automatically this picture is inserted here okay dear professors look at here this picture is inserted i can drag it and make it big see here i can drag it and make it big okay i can drag it and make it big 
process i can drag it and place it anywhere i can also make it big okay i can make it big as okay now look at here after bringing the picture you can take up the pen you can take up the pen and with the help of pen you can mark for example look at here this is brain you can tell them you can tell them this is about this is brain and this is where the heart and lungs is here lungs something like that so you can you can do that otherwise you can also use sticky note look at here there is an also option here sticky note there is an option sticky note okay i click here and write this is human human or not anatomy okay okay i just press save see sticky note is here look at your sticky note is here i can place it anywhere this is human anatomy i want to have another anatomy of monkey monkey anatomy so i would like to go for another picture look at here there is a image add image i want to compare the human anatomy and monkey anatomy go to image search and type monkey anatomy see here anatomy of monkey okay right some pictures are uh, here i can take up this picture imagine this is a skeleton of a monkey so i would like to take up this one okay i would like to take up this an insect okay so sorry if it is horrible i am very sorry if it is horrible okay right so this this one i would like to put up a sticky note as look at here i would like to put up a sticky note with different color see green color this is my skeleton of monkey skeleton of monkey so look at here i can put it here and you can bring it and place it here see skeleton of monkey okay and you see here you can also add uh, the uh, different different images different different shapes look at here i just click here see this is the intestine look at here i can click i can click an arrow i can fill the color for arrow also look at here i can fill color for arrow and put up a text here see text also can be typed see i can click the text and put up as intestine intestine okay something like that right i can keep it here i can rotate it i can keep it anywhere see right okay this is how you add sticky note or add uh, image right you can also have see a laser so you can in this laser the difference between pen and the laser is it doesn't have mark see of course this is brain see here it is highlighted but it is doesn't stay this is heart see this is intestine and this is lungs something like that look at here see this doesn't stay the lines that you make or the graphics that you make that doesn't stay okay dear process have you got it dear process so this is highlighter okay dear process now i would like to go for a new one where you can add as for example frame 2 i would like to go for frame 2 i would like to add indian map for example if you are a history teacher how do you bring click that uh, image and go for indian map or world map or whatever map it may be see bring it and you can tell them for example i just would like to take indian map empty map you can also bring empty map empty map and now you can teach them see this is about indian map yeah now you can with this you can just teach them that okay right look, look at here i can just take up the text here and put that this is the capital see i can start capital of india see? i can extend this also look at here i can extend this i can have the color also look at here i can change the color do you see that the color is changed see capital of india something like that you can also have uh, the, the big display screen indian map i just instead of capital of india i just make it as indian map okay indian map now what do i do i can i can change it i can move it anywhere see i can move the map i can move the text also now, one by one we shall see look at here i take up a pen i take up a pen option and take up a pen and with the red green color i just take this is delhi see here i just make marking as delhi you can also put up the sticky note for example this is uttar pradesh the largest state so i would like to put up a sticky note here so i just take a sticky note and put as largest state largest state okay there is a spelling mistake i'm sorry look at here see i can put it here largest state see i put up an arrow i put it as largest state okay dear process you can also explain you can use uh, the pen and you can explain right Uh, you can also highlight also see for example this is cashmere this is something something like that you can explain and you can draw anything that you want right 
sticky note is there and you can also type for example i would like to just uh, draw an arrow sorry okay i drag draw no draw an arrow and just put up a text as tamil nadu so look at here tamil see it looks bigger so i'll just reduce reduce the size look at it click here and reduce the size see here i can adjust it i can keep it here see so this is how you can use all these options now next frame i go for the next frame look at it i go for the next frame here i can also have see use of say, math, some symbols basic symbols for example look at here if you are a mathematics teacher see here i just draw another one, another picture see you can tell the students that see it can be transparent look at here, it can be transparent you can tell them that this also this picture also can be transparent look at here. you can tell the students that this is uh, a union b look at here a union b sorry this is a intersect b i am sorry a intersect b here is you can erase it look at here these are all various possibilities please explore on your own okay i just write as a intersect b okay like this and you can tell them that all these three see you can mark you can mark this column and you can tell them that and this is a union b so there are shapes also are available look at here shapes available here see arc is there square is there rectangle is there so you can you can show for example i go for next frame i can if you are a computer science teacher you can just tell them that uh, uh, this see start for example one by one you can go for maybe the flow chart flow chart see here flow chart you can also go for flow chart so you can just draw flow chart and you can explain there are options here okay flow chart and anything you can do right dear professors these are all some of the option if you want to draw perfectly see set background click here if you have the if you have experience of blackboard see you can go for blackboard see the color becomes black color becomes black okay you can have blue board you can have white board you can also have the frames frames the marks see here see frames dotted dotted frames see the background is set with dots dots okay dear professor that is with dots look at here i can with this help i can easily draw something i can easily clearly draw something okay dear professor this is about setting the background okay dear professor am i audible dear professor am i audible i'll finish it uh, just 5 minutes am i audible yes sir yes, yes sir, sir. Yeah, yeah. look at here i can setting the background you have different pictures you can also set a picture as the background you can set the picture as the background look at here you can set the picture as the background so all these are here if you want to erase this so you can clear the frame okay professor now once after doing see this this has got five look at here this has got four frames so after completing one minute look at here i had some problem okay yeah after completing see here i have got four four uh, three frames now after completion of this frame look at on the top you have three dots when i click three dots you can see here you can rename the board you can rename the board for example this is about model model 2 so if you are teaching algebra you just click the name of the sum if you are doing assignment problem something like that okay you just click the change the name and you can download this and send it to the students after writing a sum you can download it and send it to the students you can write it in the board and you can download it see the pdf file it can be downloaded as pdf file you can also download each frame as image see it has got three frames totally so every frame can be downloaded as image you can remove this you can entirely delete the frame you can make a copy of this see for example i have done a sum i want to make a copy see you can make a copy another copy is available and one more example is that see select the frame on the top look at here every frame can be made look at here there is a plus symbol you can add a frame and in each frame there is a, there is a dot see you can duplicate the frame if you want the same map you can duplicate look at here i get another one another map okay dear professors if you want to have the same anatomy see you can click here and you can get one more see duplication or delete a particular frame all these are available okay dear professors so you can very well set the background you can draw you can erase you can you can select something you can add sticky note you can add image from if you are a physics teacher you can add any gadget from if you are a science teacher you can add any gadget if you are if you want to bring about if you are talk about if you are a tamil teacher bring about silapadigaram picture of silapadigaram for example see look at here, i just go for the fourth frame fifth frame i just go to the picture 
not only for site features you can also add for example i just go to image image i go for silap adhikaram silap adhikaram so you get uh, some images about silap adhikaram you just click bring that bring that and insert about kanagi see these are all characters of uh, silap adhikaram and talk about the kanagi see you just keep the picture here and write about uh, you know kanagi okay you can write the characters of silapadi are iberum kapiyangal okay something like that you can you can do that so even english teachers tamil teachers language teachers can also make use of it effectively you can bring different pictures and uh, different attributes of the characters that you bring okay so these are all some of the options uh, the other basic shapes are here text is here and the laser highlight is here on the top you can click here and rename and here you can add frame by frame and finally you can download it by clicking here all the all that whiteboards are saved by default in your google drive so you need not save it automatically it is saved if you want to download and give it to the students you can download as a pdf file or one by one frame by frame you can download as images and give it to the students circulate it to the students for example mathematics teachers will found it will find it very simple to circulate it to the students for example preparing notes in mathematics very difficult so you can write it and download it and give it to the students that will be very useful for the students okay dear professors now over to you for clarity now over to uh, you for clarity sir uh, sir in the pen uh, format i yeah. find it very difficult to uh, write it is not coming easily smoothly is there any uh, method can you just repeat and show that again you are writing is very clear yeah. yeah see i am doing it with mouse madam uh, you can also do it see mouse may not be that feasible for us that that, that will not give us a, a clear writing so i request you to please use graphic tablet i told you in the beginning you graphic tablet there is a tool for which faculty you belong to madam, madam uh, economics faculty? Economics, economics very well because you are you will teach econometrics no you teach mathematics yeah. you teach uh, yes. statistics yes. so it is better yes. you better uh. buy a tab a tool called a graphic tablet or pen tablet look at it i showed okay. you in the beginning pen okay. tablet it, it it costs about 3000 to 25000 you can choose with a simple one pen okay. tablet or graphic tablet okay it is like a input device but look at it it's like slide Look at okay. the pen and uh, so whatever that you write, no, it comes in the screen. so you, screen. it will be okay. writing in the notebook. So it comes in the screen. Okay, madam. Okay. But when okay. we write in the when we write with the bare hands, it will be difficult for us. Okay, madam. Yeah. Okay. For example, look at here. I am just writing with the, with the yes. So it is it is quite difficult for me to write. Yes. Yes. Okay, madam. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, professor. Anybody else? Any any other clarification? So you are welcome to make your clarifications. Any clarification? You can open your mic and ask, or in the chat. Please ask me. Okay. How to create poll, Professor Rexi? Polls cannot be created using. See, you should uh, have a paid version. Please understand. You should have a paid version. Paid version of Zoom. If you have the paid version of Zoom, at the bottom you have option for. See, look at here. I just show you. It will not be shown. Look at here. There is an option. I will just. I just show you. Look at here. I'm just getting a picture. I'll show you. See, in the paid version of uh, Zoom, you have an uh, option for poll. At the bottom, you have record uh, uh, participants and so on. No, in the Zoom control, you also will have poll. So there, you create the poll, and it is a simple process. So, uh, for example, if you would like to have poll, please go through my go through my videos. There is a tool called Slido. There are so many poll tools out here. There is a tool called Slido. Use the tool Slido. You can create polls. There are uh, there are some videos available in my YouTube channel. Go to Vimal Jarod. You will find. Look at here, madam. Look at here. This is the screen that I have. Look at here. I, I just show you. See here. This is the control. This is the Zoom control. Do you see that? Look at here. This is where the poll option is available. Do you see that, madam? The poll option. Okay, madam. Poll option. Okay, madam. Have you got it? Yeah. Otherwise, please use Slido. See, this is a simple tool. Look at here, Slido. It's a tool called Slido. Look at here. Very very simple tool. And now the network is a bit slow here. That's why I'm not able to just make it very faster. Slido. Please understand it is Slido. You see, this is the one. This is the one. And you have many videos. I have I have done many videos with Slido. Please watch. Go to Vimal Jarad and type Slido. 
you get the option slido look at your sli.devo professor xi please use it and you, you can create polls you can create polls you will enjoy okay yes you want me to do it you want me to do a demo i can log in and create as poll i can it is simple process only i just do that look at it. oh you want to try okay 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 so you we have there are videos available look at here look at here. the poll here i can create a poll okay there are videos available please watch it yeah thank you any other queries dear professors any other queries dear professors if there are no queries then we shall call it a day all the very best uh, for sir, the weekend yes uh, sir in the google meet when i uh, i have tried using jamboard with my students Yeah. Uh, yeah. So uh, you know, I can see uh, you know uh, them drawing like I uh, uh, you know they have you know every frame. Uh, so about ten uh, people uh, or fifteen people, I think maximum can draw. Uh, but can that also be stored like what uh, you said? Can it be uh, um, saved? can all their jams also be saved yes 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 madam all that we can see and the students do you can you, you can see the thing is that okay. anything that you have you have control you can save it madam everything stores in your classroom okay or drive okay. drive that okay. okay everything will be stored okay. even the students and you okay. whatever that they do everything here another thing beautiful thing that you have said i will also tell remind the other participants dear participants you can very well share the board to your fellow students So you can ask them. For example, you take up a uh, just for example, you take up a map and ask them to fill the capitals of the map. You ask them to find out where the, the empty map. You ask them to find out the countries if you are a history teacher, and you share the map, and they will all be doing it in the classroom, in Google Classroom. Yes, sorry, in Google Meet, they'll be doing it. Okay. In a for example, you finish a sum with two step, and the third step you ask them to complete on their own. so each one will complete and it will be you know it will, they will submit it to you back in the assignment so very creatively we can go ahead okay madam they they will be doing their own uh, you know steps of completing the sum or uh, you know marking the for example you just give a picture and ask them to mark the different parts of uh, the gadget or the tool or an engine or a plant something like that you can very well go ahead thank you madam for reminding thank, thank you, you. Sir, I am from uh, Saint Xavier's College, Professor X. Yes, sir. Yes, uh, sir, uh, is there any free version tool for creating videos up to thirty minutes? Because we are asked to create a video for thirty uh, minutes for e-content. Fine, so, fine, is, fine. is there any free version editors? Yes, uh, very well, can... very well, madam, very well. Uh, can you wait for another uh, day? Yeah, we yeah. Explore yes. it on yes. Monday. Monday okay, we are going to yes, explore sir. Windows Movie Maker, Open ah. Shot also beyond that, Open Shot Unlimited, Unlimited. Okay, we will sir. use ah. Unlimited. Okay. Okay. Sir. Uh, thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Thank sir. you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Sir, I'm not able to upload my uh, assignment today. Uh, it's saying the. Uh, uh, I think, uh, madam, madam, actually yeah. the problem is. I guess the problem is. See, we have. We are yeah. supposed to actually send the link. If you send the link, the space is less. I think many of the participants have uploaded their video itself. That is why okay. I think the space is filled. Space is filled. Okay. That's why we are not able to do it. And we will discuss with the organizers, and we will let you know, madam, what could be done. Yes, don't worry. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Dr. Jack Moore. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Swakin sir. Swakin sir is my teacher uh, who uses uh, all the ICT tools. Thank you, sir, for the compliment. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you so much, sir. This is an extra class after the extra class. Thank you. <laughs> thank really, you. as thank one you. participant has. Uh, mentioned here we are learning unlimited so this is an unlimited package of learning really we are overwhelmed by your dedication uh, as i have already know, told you so we have to learn many things from you sir my Thai pleasure madam my yes. pleasure my pleasure till the thank end you. with the same smiling face and i also thank all the participants who have uh, participated till then we have been seeing more than 100 participants only now the number has reduced so they are learning at least 66 of them are here to learn so their eagerness for knowledge everything really awesome and really big salute and hats up to you sir and also to all the participants thank you thank you thank you, thank you. <laughs>
thank you thank you very much madam thank you very much for the compliments thank you very much dear participants for the compliments one query by dr sunita uh, professor there is no like uh, google me like uh, you know for like zoom you do not have option for uh, you know turning off the videos see recently i just go through recently there are there are uh, things you know you can control you can have control over individual participants not as a whole dr sunita have you got it individually you can control individually you can control but for video there is no control only with the participants participant choice if they are improving a lot google meet they are improving a lot slowly uh, we will we will definitely have it yeah right now there is no option to control the videos of the participants sir how Thank much participants can be accommodated in uh, google meet if we have g suite sir yeah g suite madam there are two types of account in g suite madam g suite for academic education that allows 100 madam 100 if you pay extra maximum of 250 see even oh. uh, paid version also even for corporate events also yeah, only 250 can like be permitted only 250 maximum only 250 even in the academic version for example we use uh, st joseph's college we use uh, g suite account only but we have only 100 participants because limited version education version so it permits only 100 if you want to go beyond 100 we will have to pay we will have to pay but it is unlimited for 100 it is unlimited Yeah. Okay, sir. Okay. And one more information I want to give to the participant. There is also there is one uh, meet Geo meet. See, Zoom yes. doesn't permit to go beyond forty minutes. There is also similar to Geo the Zoom Geo meet. Geo meet that allows oh. unlimited time with hundred participants. Unlimited time with hundred. Only hundred. Okay. Yeah, hundred. Unlimited. Microsoft. Uh, what, what about Microsoft Teams, sir? Have you tried? Yeah, my yes, my Microsoft team uh, completely paid, madam. You know you can you can join on the meeting, but it should oh. be yeah yeah. You have to go for pay. It is paid version, madam. It depends. They okay. customize and give you, madam. Okay. They customize and give you for the institution, for corporates, for individuals. There are different packages. You will not write to them. They will make okay. it. See, when you go for teams, they also give space for classrooms. You can integrate the classroom also, yes. like you know Google Classroom, of uh, synchronous as well as, well as uh, asynchronous. Like we have Google Meet and Google Classroom, no? Google Meet is synchronous and Google Classroom yes, is yes, asynchronous. Yes. Team that uh, yes. integrates both. So you, you have separate, uh, you know, okay. places to store assignments, store your boards, and all that. You can straight away teach them. You can store them. You can also give homeworks using Teams. There are options. Likewise, Cisco also. Yes. Cisco, WebEx, Cisco yes. also. What is the use of co-host in Zoom? Okay. Professor Sunita, co-host option is post uh, is the one who starts the meeting. co-host can also do what uh, the host can do for example admitting participants also you can mute them unmute them you can uh, you can stop the video of somebody so or you can share see why the co-host option is given for example right now at the beginning all are muted only co-host and host can unmute them right now everybody can mute because anybody can unmute because we have opened uh, the audio for everyone so co-host will have the privilege of host so that you can unmute yourself and others and you have some other privileges too like sharing and all that yeah for example if you have five speakers only the five speakers alone are allowed to share the sharing of uh, content otherwise you know students so they will be sharing unknowingly they will be doing all these so we can have control over we have control bar at the bottom security option is there you can have control over thank you thank you dear professors any other queries dear professors any other queries you can ask anything any other than so it's, it's only optional optional session so you need not feel hesitant to ask if you have any other query you can put it in the chat or open your mic and ask something relevant to ict or online teaching digital tools any other dear professors i think professors are very tired okay have a nice day have a nice weekend okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, thank you, madam. Any any queries? Okay, if not, if no queries, then we shall call it a day. Thank you, madam. Yes. So nice of you. Yes. I appreciate thank the you. organizers and the participants who waited till so long listening to me. Thank you very much. Have a great evening. We will come back to you with a solution for the assignment problem that we have. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank, thank you, dear professors. Thank. You.